Let's go. Guys, I'm out to try something different. You know me and my food. And it feels real good to wake up in the morning. It feels good. That's yeah. That, that's Tony, Tony, Tony. <laughs> it feels good. Yeah. It feels good to wake up in the morning and have just a breakfast and connect to a good conversation. Here we go. Oh, we got some Tony boys left today. Got some boys in the house. That's that's pre that's the presupposition is that you have been. Yeah, he knows how to do it. He knows how to do it. Cool greens. That's here in Tulsa. Cucumber, tomatoes. Um, yeah. This one has chicken. You can get them vegan if you want. But no matter how you're feeling about health and wellness, or how you feeling about, I'm sorry, how you feeling about life with uh, everything that's going on, you know, coronavirus, it, it brings more awareness to health. Oh, yeah, spice pecans. Garbage in, garbage out. And so when you eat, you want to think healthy. Packaged foods, I eat them. It's not really about doing the right thing or the correct thing. It's just doing something to get an understanding of health and wellness in your life. And how, how items or things are made is very important. At least if it's not on a consistent basis. It's thought about. There's a reason why we have health food stores like natural grocers and Whole Foods. Whole Foods is kind of more of a just a natural natural store, but it's it's huge. It's a very very big store. Been around for a long, long time since you know Wild Oats was another one. And Whole Foods has gotten some trouble for taking advantage of people. And not just, and really it's more their pricing model was messed up. It's like, so oh, since it's organic, it should be expensive. It does cost money to produce food in a different manner, industrialized food. But at the same time, when a person put their heart into what they make, and the ingredients are farm fresh. something and that is what are you doing in your life that brings life to your life abundant life it deals with more than just money money it deals with more than just uh, material things but also to me a, an abundant life de deals with health and wellness as you want to manifest things that are good into your life you want to manifest good a good healthy life and the experience of the full potential is a life lived that's had a time to contemplate, had a time to understand, had a time to meditate, had a time to become and to understand it as it runs the program. Inheritance Juicery is a plant-based restaurant, I would say, but it has juice. Juices are good for you because it provides certain elements uh, that our bodies need. Do you enjoy it? Some people don't. Uh, I enjoy it. Of course, it does have an atmosphere that can get in the way of what it actually is about because people can see it as uh, yuppie or snooty. Um, they can see it as something just expensive, but essentially having whole foods and plants in your life
can benefit you, no different than uh, cannabinoids can benefit you in the right manner. Uh, cannabinoids are, are, are like cannabis endocannabinoids, which is a phytocannabinoid, but we have endocannabinoids, and so this can affect your body in a, in a certain way. Of course, juice contains sugar, natural sugars, but there's other juices in there. Um, to juxtaposition it, we have inheritance, and then across the street we have Hertz Donuts. And some people enjoy having a donut from time to time. I don't really necessarily enjoy it. I have gotten myself to the point where I might bite something like that, but it doesn't resonate with me. Don't get it wrong. My kids will tell you that cookies resonate with me. I love a good chocolate chip or just a good dense cookie. And I like healthy, natural ingredients, um, even if it's sugar. This is inherited so in Tulsa. But if you have a juice place and you've never done a juice before, don't look at it as expensive. Look at it as your body needs nutrients. Your body needs something, right? Things that actually make it work. And so as we try to manifest and get closer and draw closer to our inner man and our inner self spiritually, there is a lot to do with the outside world and how you take it in. This is inherited.